Hello everyone, and welcome again. In this video, I explain how to create and deploy a warning banner on client computers joined to a domain using group policy in Windows Server. Login banners are used to provide warnings to users who access systems for legal purposes or in an unauthorized manner. They also contain information for authorized users regarding what constitutes acceptable use of the system. Hence, these are also called interactive login messages. Let's start. First, open the Server Manager dashboard, then click on the Tools menu at the top of the page, and from the menu, click on Group Policy Management. Then expand the forest on the left side, and select the domain you will work on. Then right-click on the organizational unit you want, and select Create a GPO in this domain, and link it here. In the new GPO window, enter an appropriate name for this policy so that it can be easily accessed, at any time. And click the OK button. Then right-click on the GPO we just created, and select Edit. This will open the Group Policy Management Editor window. After that, expand the folders from the left side to open the path that appears in front of you on the screen, and I will leave the path for you in the description of the video. After that, open the interactive logo and message title, for users attempting to logo on policy from the other side of the available policies. Check the box next to define this policy setting, and in the field, write the title of the message that will appear, to domain users. Then, click on the apply button and OK, and then double click on the interactive logo and message text for users attempting to logo on policy. Check the box next to define this policy setting in the template, and in the field write the warning message you want, to appear to users. Type the text that you think is appropriate for you. You can close the Group Policy Management Editor window now, and after that I will open the client computer, to verify that the policy is applied to the users. From the client computer, open the Command Prompt window, type the Update Group Policy command, and then restart the computer, so that it saves the new changes made to the Group Policy. Once you click Ctrl Alt Delete to log in, a warning banner will appear with the message that we entered while creating the GPO. After that you can log in normally on the client computer. The login banner is supposed to contain information regarding what is considered appropriate use of the system. The system is under supervision to detect unauthorized and illegal activities and that privacy cannot be expected while using the system. They are often used in organizations for legal reasons. When these warning messages are not used, organizations become legally vulnerable to unauthorized employees, using the systems for illegal purposes. I hope the video is useful to you. And thank you for watching. I also hope you subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.